Hello everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Again, I'm Gina from Gina Renee RM Budgets. I'm a zero-based budgeter who utilizes the cash and cashless envelope system to help me manage my finances and assist me on my journey to debt freedom. Today I have another weekly grocery haul for you. Um, I'll insert my meal plan so you can see that I really didn't have much to get. So I kind of got some of the staples and kind of took advantage of things that were on sale in addition to things that I knew I would need for the upcoming holiday. I went to Kroger as usual. So got my receipt right here. So let's get started. So first thing I got is two of the Marie calendars. They're on sale two for six. So I got a pot pie and I guess pork and gravy. Um, it was also a coupon for a dollar off of two for those. Uh, next, I got the TGI Friday appetizers. Those were on the mega sale for $4.99. The Checkers French fries, my kids love those. They were on the mega sale for $1.99. The Edwards cheesecake, I'm gonna freeze this and take it to my baby up in at my parents' house when I go. My daughter lives there. And she loves cheesecake, so I'm gonna take that to her. Then I got just this little bag of frozen peas because it's a cool rainy day in Nashville. So I'm, um, as soon as I finish this, I'm putting on a pot of beef stew. So I like to add peas at the end. The craft singles there on Mega Sale for $1.97. Uh, the big cheese in the back, of course, getting ready for that holiday macaroni and cheese. They were, I think they're 32 ounces each one, and they were on sale for only $3.97 each. Um, then the sliced cheese, my husband just eat this just right <laughs> out of the package, or sometimes, for some reason, he'll lay like a bunch of pieces on a on bread and make a grilled cheese instead of just getting a whole slice. I don't know. But anyway, <laughs> whatever floats his boat. And then the pork loin was on sale for $1.77 a pound. So I just got a small one because we always end up having a lot left over. The granola bars, there's two boxes here. Um, I had a coupon for a dollar off two, but one of the boxes I had a coupon for free. So I don't know how much I ended up paying for all that, but you get the you get the message. Sour cream, the Daisy sour cream, a do, uh, on sale for a dollar forty nine. The Jello pudding, gotta get ready for my banana pudding for the holidays. I got one one French vanilla and one banana cream. They were two for three. Uh, what's next? Coffee. For my husband, you guys, I don't drink coffee. So that's for my husband. Those were on sale for $2.99 each. And those are his favorite flavors. Where's the butter? The Land of Lakes butter, still on sale for $2.49. I only got two because I got some last week. Uh, drinks, 99 cent each if you bought five. My son took one already. Um, and then I had a dollar, no, wait a minute. Six, 50 cent off two of the Canada Dries. 65 cent off of three for the other ones. So I ended up paying like four bucks, I think, for all five. It was a good deal, whatever I ended up paying. Back to the Betty Crocker potatoes. They're on mega sale for 99 cents. The Minute Rice, uh, mega sale, $1.49. The Velveeta shells and cheese, I want to say is mega sale $2.49, but I had a coupon for $0.60 cents off one. The beef broth and then the chicken broth is right behind it. I needed the beef broth for my beef stew, so I just got the big containers instead. This 12-pack is for my son. It was specifically for the Mountain Dew, this new one, Thrashed Apple. This was $5.49. They're on sale three for 12. 
but I had a coupon for this flavor, $2 off. So the 12 pack ended up being $3.49. Then the Heinz ketchup, that's a 20 ounce, $1.97. These little Mountain Dew energy drinks were two for four. And I had a dollar off of two coupons, so two for three. Uh, all my red gold tomatoes were all 49 cent a can, so I stocked up on those. The carnation milk for my macaroni and cheese was a dollar or a dollar 25. The pineapples, where's the pineapples? Pineapples for a ham. Uh, $1.25 a can. The Campbell's soup, cream soups were all 75 cents. I got tomato paste because I needed a little bit for my stew today. Honey crisp apples, I get apples every week and those are our favorites. Uh, $1.69 a pound. The yellow, red, and orange bell peppers were all still on sale for 99 cents. And then I keep getting the same coupon for this for free. It was $1.25, but it took that off for free. Then my baby's dog food, it was $8.49, but I had a coupon for $3 off of one. So that was good. Um, this little bottle of wine, I needed it for my stew to um, deglaze my pan. So I always use a little bit of red wine. So that was $4.50. Of course, our staples, if you watch my grocery haul, this is my husband's all time favorite drink is the zero calorie sweet tea, the Milo specifically, and it's $3.29 each. Oh, the 10 pound bag of rusted potatoes is $1.97. So I thought that was a good deal. I did get some household stuff. So the Kroger toilet paper is like 72 rolls, basically 18 equals 72. It's on sale for $9.99 and there's a dollar off coupon. The Snuggle scent boosters are $2.99. There's a dollar off coupon. Those razors, the Hydro Skin, they're $7.99 and there's a $6 off one coupon. The Febreze was $2.49 on sale and there's a dollar off one coupon. And the body washes, a dollar, between a dollar forty-nine, I think the St. Ives, and then the Irish Spring and Soft Soap was $1.99. The Sure deodorant was not from Kroger. I just ran by CVS to see if they had it, plus I needed to deposit some money. And I do it at CVS for Capital One 360. If you guys didn't know that, you can deposit cash at CVS and it will go directly into your bank account. And it's free. CVS, the Sure Deodorant or Brute is $2 on sale and you get a $2 extra care book back, making it free. My original total, I wanna say before I put in my Kroger number was like 200 and $48. So it went down from say 250 down to we'll say 160. So this 74 that I saved plus the six she gave me back made it $80 that I saved on my groceries this time. So I think everything was a very good deal. And that's all I have for this week. Let me go ahead and get to my uh, beef stew. Thank you to the people that said I did a good job on my first filming while cooking. It's so hard, but I'm going to try to keep it up, but it probably just won't be that often. I'd rather just show a picture of the finished product. But if you like that video and you guys want me to kind of continue here and there, I will if you guys are willing to watch it. So let me know in the comments down below if you're not subscribed already. Come on now, what you waiting for? Go ahead and subscribe, turn on your notification bell. Um, give me a like if you like grocery hauls. And this is, like I said, I live in Nashville, Tennessee. So this is the prices that we see here in Nashville. Nashville tends to be 
on the pricier side to me um but yeah so that's all i have you guys have a blessed day and i'll catch you next time bye guys one eternity later hello everyone welcome back to my channel it's gina again i'll add a meal plan in here somewhere uh we don't necessarily go in that in the order of our meal plan i just make sure i have something for each day um up until i go back to the store so we may you know mix up the days we, we may even mix up the meals, like, you know, change the veggies around or the sides around. Just kind of depends on what we have a taste for. But at least we have a basic knowledge of what we can have and that we have everything we need in order to make it happen. So for me, that helps us save because then I don't have to go back and forth to the store a lot. And I don't have time to anyway. So let's get started. This is Kroger again. That's like my go-to grocery store. Kroger prices are high unless it's a sale. So you'll see certain things like I really only get the sale stuff. Okay. So starting down here, my husband loves all the holiday type drinks that come out around Christmas. He really prefers the Canada Dry uh, cranberry ginger ale but it's really hard to find it in diet so i'm gonna try this store called Publix to see because that's really his favorite so um but i got him this sprite zero sugar winter spiced cranberry i don't know about that y'all but he'll drink it anyway um these were 99 cent yeah that sounds right but you had to buy a certain amount but i gave my son a couple already so let's see where we're starting all right the outshine bars i got two boxes they were um two for four dollars i think yeah i'm looking at my thing now simply lemonades the different flavors they were two for five and i had a dollar off two coupons so two for four so i thought that was really good um underneath the kroger brand ice cream sandwiches um, or $1.77 for the weekly, the weekly deal. Let's see. Uh, the Orita French fries for the, I guess you would call it their mega sale, $1.97 a bag. Um, these rice, they weren't on sale. They were $2.99. I probably could get them cheaper at Walmart, but my son likes them, so I just grabbed them. Uh, and he'll get them whenever. The pot stickers. This is a favorite of myself and my husband. So I was looking for the private selection ones. They were on sale, but I couldn't find them. So I just got these pagoda ones. They were $3.79. Shrimp, now, have you, I don't even think I've ever done a haul <laughs> where we didn't get shrimp. That's like our favorite thing in the world is shrimp. Like you could do so much with shrimp. Not just that, it's good for you. It's high in protein. Like it's keto friendly. It's, shrimp is just shrimp is just everything. Okay, I could eat shrimp, seafood, really every single day. So these were um, it's a two pound bag for fifteen ninety eight, and they're the thirteen to fifteen count. So nice big shrimp, and so seven ninety nine a pound. That is a great deal. I'm probably gonna send my husband to on his way home from work to grab maybe two more bags <laughs> we'll use them that's for sure <laughs> the um kroger brand i'm not gonna turn the camera the kroger brand italian sausage is uh 297 i think yeah 297 and then you know butter butter shrimp and butter you can't go wrong okay if you don't eat nothing else you can have shrimp scampi <laughs> with all you need is some garlic okay and a little pasta a little lemon juice see y'all um, but the butter, $1.77 each, okay? That is a great deal. You can only get five per transaction. Also, I had a coupon for $1.10 off of two Kroger butter. So I haven't done the math, but basically, I don't know. I got those butters for like $1.50. Does that sound right on the fly? Pillsbury pie crust, where are they? Okay, so these are two for five and I had a coupon for a dollar off three. So I got those cinnamon rolls back there 
and they're also two for five. But I got two crusts so I can make my peach cobbler and you'll see the sliced peaches that I have right there. Yes, I used the cans, but when you if you tasted my peach cobbler, you would fall in love and you could care less if I got them from the can, off a tree or whatever. <laughs> um, anything I talk about, guys, when I'm doing my grocery hauls, if you guys, one, I can't film myself cooking. I need help. And I never have anybody that can film me. My kitchen is not conducive to filming. Like the setup of where my oven is, it's like really tight. So it's hard to film, but I will be more than happy to share my recipes with you guys. I'm, I'm not funny acting like that, like it's a big family secret or something. So that's that. The ricotta cheese in the back was $3.49. I'm going to make some manicotti, I think. I might make it today. I'm not sure, but I'm going to make it. That's on one, That's on my list, I think, somewhere. Now, the Kroger cheese, four for $6. So I got the quesadilla one. I got a pizza one, the mild cheddar, and I got mozzarella. Domino sugar, where are you? Back here. Um, $2.99 for that. I don't care about having name brand except for the holidays when I'm making my peach cobbler, my sweet potato pies, stuff like that. I prefer to use Domino Sugar. I don't know. It's just me. It probably ain't even no difference. Um, the taco shells, a dollar. So I got those. Um, the brown sugars. I don't know where my other one is. I got three somewhere. They're three for five. Uh, it might have fell out and it's still in the car. Um, spinach back here, $1.99 because when I make my, my, my manicotti, I make it with, um, the ricotta and then I saute spinach and mushrooms in it. Then of course I add the Parmesan and Reggiano cheese. And then after I stuff them, I make my tomato, my pasta sauce into a meat sauce. So I brown up my Italian sausage in there and pour it on top with some more mozzarella cheese. Ooh, don't get me started. Okay, cinnamon rolls, I already talked about those. Um, the Parmesan cheese, of course, is for my manicotti whenever I make them. And those were, it was $2.19 and I had a 50 cent off coupon. Where's my shrimp? I'm about to eat this, so I got that $5. Uh, these drinks, where are they? These Mountain Dew Rises, my son likes them and they're two for four and I had a dollar off two coupon. The mushrooms were $1.69 and I'll put those in my manicotti. The Lay's chips, those you had to buy three, but when you buy three, they were $1.99 or something like that, I forget. Um, so I got the Lay's, the Cheetos and the Fritos. Then the Sara Lee, ooh, good. these some good rolls right here. These were $1.97. That is a good deal. They have the regular, like, I don't know, dinner rolls, like the white ones, but these, these almost remind you of like the bread they had at Cheesecake Factory. Whew, I can't eat none though. Um, let's see, apple juice somewhere, two more. I always get apple juice for my grandson. Because he loves it and uh, it keeps him regular. <laughs> um, the um, hefty coffee cups, to-go cups, they were $4.99. I had a dollar off one coupon. Where's my sweet potatoes? My sweet potatoes for my sweet potato pies. I still have to get the crust, though. I didn't see those on sale. But they were only $0.39 cent a pound. And I got, like, four pounds. So that'll make maybe two or three sweet potato pies and i like the smaller potatoes when i know i'm gonna make the pies my grandson's cuties the pineapples were a dollar 47. where's my press and seal the press and seal oh this is my favorite it works like a charm it was 359 i had a dollar off one coupon the dawn power wash the kits they were on sale for 849 and then there's a $2 off one coupon in the app. All right. So this is what I got. I had a coupon clip for, I think if you spend $30, they give you 400 fuel points 
or something like that. So I think overall my total was two, two thirty something. And then after all my coupons and all that good stuff, it was down to one forty five. So my grocery and household budget is like one twenty. So I just use say twenty five out of my spending money because this hopefully will take us all the way through because we'll only be home for a few days next week and we'll be in Chicago. And I did get all my fuel points. Where is it at? So I earned 500 and no, wait a minute. Something, oh, 555 I earned today. So we have 790. So I'm going to go do the butter deal again and get 10 more points. So that'll give us 800 points and that's 80 cent off per gallon. And we use premium and it's time for my husband to put gas in the car. So, you know, I be holding on to my gas money, but at least I do let him use the fuel points. <laughs> so he'll have 80 cents off the gallon. He'll be happy about that. So, um, yeah, that's it. Kroger, I will put my uh, meal plan up. Guys, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Give me a thumbs up if you love grocery hauls like me. I'm nosy, so I like to watch grocery hauls. And um, put on your notification bell. So every time I put up a video, you guys will be first. You guys have a great, great day. I'm going to record my cash stuffing, I think, in the morning and post it tomorrow. So maybe I might put this grocery haul up today. We'll see. But you guys have a good one. Thanks for watching. Please come back. God bless.